this is one of those right here. Okay. So this is one of the places we're fishing right now. Um, basically, we just we're out in the back country. We have no clue what this place is called. We got out here by four wheeling, as you saw. It's pretty fun. The only downside right now is it's absolutely pouring. We are drenched from head to toe, Ken and I. But yeah. It's fun. Just a little one. It's a very interesting place right here. The other side is quite weedy. If you want, I was just coming over here to look. Give it a whirl over here. You can't exactly take a ton out here into the backcountry on ATVs, so, I mean, if we could, then this would be, like, an incredible place to fish topwater frogs, I think. In my opinion, why don't you look at that? Tell me what you think. Leave a note down in the comments what you think about that. All right, boys, Kitten caught a fish. He's on at least. Oh, nice. Pickerel? Is he a pickerel or is he a pickerel? Yeah, he's a pickerel. Yeah? This guy's gonna cut me. On the Phantom Martin, guys. Nice. It's really healthy. Yeah. He really choked that. Okay, I gotta get the fire for the guy. I bet! But yeah. King just caught a fish. Nice. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Things are looking good though, so. Head back out, but yeah. Alright guys, so after about an hour of riding around, we've got to here. This is our goal. It's a small little stream, but we have seen fish in here in the past. I'm using a little Panther Martin. I'm hoping to get hit by something. But, oop! I just got a bite right there. Already. So, this is going to be good. I think. I've already gotten hit. That's hilarious. And there's a beautiful bridge right there, Katie. And there's a fishing line stuck in that tree right there. Look at that. Nice cat. Yeah, there's a couple other little uh, puddles up in there. My fishing is that waterfall as well, oxygen on there. Yeah. Oh, what a 
Yeah. Got one. Here. Nice small one. Is it a smallie? Yeah. Nice little smallie. I got more of these in a bag. Hey, Got another one. Oh, came off right here, too. You're what? I don't smell watermelon. Oh, your bag? What are you... Alright guys, I am walking up to the dam right here. There's a nice dam. It pours into a little pool and I'm going to fish the pool and then fish right above the dam, which looks pretty good. It's actually pretty loud over here, so if you can't hear me, I'm sorry. I'll raise my voice a little bit, but it's pretty nice. Whoa! This little guy just nailed it. He's a pretty dark smallie. Barely hooked him too. Nice little guy. And that was right in the waterfall. He chased it all the way up to about right there. Watched to meet it. Pretty cool though. Got another one. Wow, this is a much lighter smallie. There are a lot of smallie right here. And they're aggressive too, but the good thing is... They only eat one treble hook, so... Beautiful little spot with aggressive smallmouth. No way, another one? Nice. Tang. Fourth smallmouth on my fourth cast up here. Healthy little buggers. Oh, nah. Bye. Dang. I'm enjoying this. So I've actually never fished this little spot here. Last time I came ATVing, last year, we came over here and we just saw this and we I just knew I had to fish it. And this is why. Absolutely slaying these little smallmouth. Uh, okay, this guy hooked himself good. Not 
bad. Release. Broken streak. But oh well. Alright guys, it's really shallow up here, but um I just came up here to see if I can catch anything. I don't I'm not sure that I will though. But actually a beautiful little pond up here so I bet that fish do live in it just not right here because it's so shallow making a couple of casts and then I'm gonna go back to fishing down in the pool below the dam all right yeah I'm going down to fish them. Kaden, waterfall. Another one. Absolutely slaying. These little main backwoods smallmouth. The waterfall. Yo, know, there's a smallie that just swam up here. Alright guys, so I walked down here to the bridge, the nice little pool up there, and uh, so I'm just going to take a couple casts off this, there's a little more flowing water, which I'm going to see if I can get anything, oh, I already got a bite, this is nice, bridge, now, and there are several pools down here where the water slows down for a second and then speeds back up. So I'm gonna try fishing those. Like right here. This is one of those spots. It's like just a little mini segment. Got one. Very small guy. Something that I wasn't expecting to see in this river. A little archery. There he goes. That's why he didn't bite again. I was confused because he didn't chase it. when I got the bite earlier from him, I was all confused, like, that's not behavior of a smallmouth. And I wondered if it could have been a trout, but trout basically have behavior 
a small mouth. So that really confused me. I mean, that guy isn't going to get big, but... Alright. Alright guys, so we're going to leave soon. And, um... I'm just trying to find spot that I haven't fished yet to fish like out here is a nice spot because I can cast out over there on the other hand there's a tree so that's gonna make things difficult oh got one nice first cast I need to look the smallmouth here are aggressive they just want to eat what they're doing it's, it's so aggressive right here but it makes them vulnerable to us And another one. But, yeah. These smallmouth here. I've come up here one last time to send a couple of casts before we go, and yeah. Because I've caught so much up, up here earlier, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to catch anything again, but... I'm going to send some.